Hey guys, Uncle Ray. Welcome to another episode of the Crypto Bellwether. Look, it's getting late in the night, and uh, you know we've had a long week. We've got a lot of turmoil throughout the world right now. I don't want to get into the global politics, but I wanted to do this last video uh, to show you a swing trade that I think is a very good risk reward. Now, when I talk about risk reward, I'm not uh, talking about the risk in general of blockchain and crypto. I'm just talking about for the amount of money you put in, the risk of how much you should make if it all works out. So let's talk about Trader Joe, J O E. Now, look, Trader Joe is a DEX on Avalanche. It's very powerful, it's a wonderful utility, it has uh, farming liquidity pools trading staking you name it it has it so i personally think it's going to be around for a long time and it serves a purpose that's what i look at now look right now it's under a dollar guys under a dollar could it go lower absolutely but look where it was just a little over two months ago it was over five dollars guys so you can forex your money just if it goes back two months ago. And if you've been trading or following crypto at all, you know two months worth of uh, making up ground can come in a day. That's not a big move in crypto for Trader Joe to go from a dollar to five dollars. It just did it slowly in two months. Well, if we have some good positive reg regulatory information comes out with like the SEC with uh, um, XRP or if Russia just says, hey, we're, you know, we're going to back off, whatever. There's a thousand different reasons this thing could take off and run two or three X. I mean, literally in a week, guys. Uh, so my thoughts are. Two, three years from now, Trader Joe's still going to be around. It's still going to be a powerful DEX with Avalanche. So I think right now you could go ahead and deploy all your money. But if you followed me at all, you would know that I normally break my money into like a third. Well, right now with Avalanche and looking at the history and where it's been, I'm thinking go ahead and put about 75% in right here under a dollar and just sit back and watch. If it falls apart, I'll go ahead and deploy the last 25%. I would normally break that up more, but just being where it's trading, I don't have time to keep watching it. Um, so I think I'm going to go ahead and deploy 75% under a dollar. And if it happens to go down a little more, deploy the other 25%. If I wake up and it's up in here, just let it go. And guys, this shouldn't be that long of a trade. It's more of a swing trade. Uh, that being said, this is a long-term hold if you want it to be. No if and buts about it. But my thought process right now is that in 2022, we are going to have a big move in Britain. Bitcoin, a big move, and everything else is going to follow. And when it does, when it takes out the 70,000 or the 68,000, whatever the old high is, when it makes that charge, this old high is going to be done. And we will have forexed our money. It should probably run even more after that. Uh, I'm not looking to keep going. I will probably sell out up in here up in here and i might leave say 10 percent and let it run you know as high as it can run depending on what's going on in the world that's the way i like to do things once that's said and done my money is probably going in uh in cash and it's going to be uh ready to be deployed on the next pullback back into bitcoin because long term i think bitcoin is the place to be uh when you weigh out the risk reward Yes, you're not going to get the 4X, 5X, 10X, 100X. You're not going to get all that. But I have different trades for that. But the bulk of your money 
in my opinion, if you're going to trade crypto, it should be in Bitcoin. That's just my personal opinion. Anyway, guys, excuse me. Anyway, guys, I just want you to take a look at Trader Joe. I think it's a great risk reward trade, not financial advice. And like I said, when I talk about risk reward, I'm not talking about just typical crypto risk. There are risks, but this is a good trade um, to put on right now. Because look, if Bitcoin just run, turns around and runs back up to say 48,000, this thing would probably run over. 250 and you could do a short-term trade and that's a 1x uh, a 2x right out of the bat really short term so break it down any way you want if not you can just buy and buy and buy and load the boat and cut off your computer and hold it for five years i think that'd be a good trade uh but anyway guys uh if you haven't subscribed please do so hit the like button uh, share with like-minded people. Leave some comments. If you're not trading right now or if you think I'm wrong, leave that in the comments and come back. Be part of this community. And uh, that's all I got for you guys. Thank you.